Mm, three, two, one, action. This is a big surprise coming at you. We out here, Foco, horse tooth. Look at this loveliness. We just got in straight trouble. <laughs> we weren't camping and we went because we needed shade. It is dastardly hot out here. Am I real sweaty? Is it okay? <laughs> uh, it was dastardly hot. So I'm making a rainbow of bubbles for a very, very destined fairy friend of mine. And I'm shaking because we just got in trouble and we had to like forage for a place and find a new space. And it was scary. And he told us we couldn't be doing any of the things that we were doing. So we went the other direction. It's real hot. I'm going to show you my crazy cool swimsuit and do it real awkwardly so that every awkward thing possible happens. So we out here, pandemic lifestyle 2021, we in the sun. I have a really special surprise in store, so I got to go fast because the birds are about to attack us. They're coming after us. We were enjoying each other's company far too much. And so we got in trouble. And that's the kind of trouble you should always be getting into with your destined people. The people for whom you are destined. So hopefully there's not too many creases in my forehead. We've been, we've been out here, uh, you know, breaking the law. We've just been breaking the law and stuff. And I have another butterfly for you. So we're, I love you so much. we're interacting with our camera crew here. <laughs> Um, another one for me just because I feel like I need more blank. You feel me? Yes, I was going to ask you if you would show your beautiful <laughs> self and I was going to just make sure that you got in it. Although I think you show that bathing suit. You know what I mean? You'll take all my followers. This should have happened earlier, but here it is now. We're going to maybe get a ticket too, but who cares? This is love, people. This is love. <laughs> That's what matters. So, and we out here with Gizmo too, obviously. Gizmo san, keeping it real in the sun. So, today's poem, day 158, which is a great day, is called Our Story is a Real Page Turner. Spelt, you know, you know, you know. <sighs> Sorry guys. Got to have my butterfly right to do it right. This is a this is a secret pact thing between us. We're in a we're in a cult of <laughs> butterflies. <sighs> you, let's let this loud guy go by. You can't have loud guys in this holy magic. Shh. Our story is a real page turner. You are a bubble wand, river song, prismatic, crystalline, magic dream, rainbow catcher, hope hatcher, hatcher of tattered parts, giving heart, and rainbow-sized smile of grace, a mosaic princess who beams out blessings with her knowing face, and traces the skyline with reverence to a swirling watercolor origin place deep in a space you've known longer than you've known you knew it. There's a secret path of wildflowers that leads straight through it. And you grew it, seed by precious seed, feeding what has always fed you, a brighter chance, a bluer blue, a true beyond true, more and more possible within you. You are literally, actually, factually one of the brightest lights in this entire universe. Facts. Every time I'm lucky enough to see you, you make the world new. Your kindness makes up for the warmth that others lack. You've lifted me from so down low on more occasions than I could possibly know or track. With a constancy that blows me away, you've always had my back. The first time we ever spoke for more than a few moments, you let me unpack my entire heart contents, all bent up and on fire with anger over a stupid man-child. I didn't even know how to start with the healing, and the feeling of bitterness eating me up was running wild. You are a child of angelic elements, a compiled masterpiece gifted with a myriad of dazzling qualities. 
same guy. <laughs> a masterpiece gifted with a myriad of dazzling qualities, like the clemency, grace, and peace that much of this world is depleted of. You are living love. Clover honey and lavender and moonbeam magic of the highest caliber. That's what you are made of. Your open and profusely kaleidoscopic heart, giving to me fully on any and all topics, is what bolstered me up in one of my darkest times. You cut through the thickest jungle vines, covering up the path to my shine, shine, shine. You insisted that I keep my light up, even when I kept reaching for the dimmer switch. You enriched the soil of my being so that honeysuckle and huckleberries and fairy gardens could again grow. Darling, you guided me back from the shadowy side in more ways than you can ever know. I don't think you fully understand that before I met you, I couldn't even hear the bird songs or the river flow. I had stuck myself in a corner and told myself there was nowhere left to go. Your glow was like a lighthouse to me in a terrifying, capsizing storm. Whatever you achieve, whatever you achieve in this world, and I know it will be so much, never let the world touch your coruscating, stained glass colored wings or make you conform. Never let them convince you to hide the Olympic torches inside your carnelian agate topaz tourmaline colored eyes so warm. You were born to diverge and diffuse the bruise of darkness on the soul of this earth. To emit your rapturous shine and if you don't realize it truly, I insist that you must. Your entire existence is beyond pulcrudinous, pulcritudinous, pulcritudinous. That means great beauty. I just looked it up and learned it today. Pulcritudinous. Just looked it up today. You have a way of pushing me and others, I'm quite sure, to be more and more awake. The energy you exude is like a nude and joyous dip in an alpine lake. Never ever let this mean world take your invigorating, beaming bubble away. Every single time I'm blessed to be near you, it's like I'm given. Hooray after hooray. It's like the gods actually harvested a solar and a lunar ray and mixed them together into a human vessel. Your presence is like prolific Eden roses blooming as they climb a tall Shakespearean trestle in a mystical garden. Shut down any force that attempts to darken the canopy of stars that is your very beating sweet heart. Protect it in a box lined with the finest velvet and covered in precious gems and alloy metals. Do not let the pervasive cynicism cause it to rust. Honey, your words are magical pixie dust, making my soul believe on deeper and deeper levels. Your voice nestles into hidden aches and takes hold with such healing, unveiling my worth. You are hand selected by the universe, just saturated with light. You delight my fairy DNA. There's the ice cream truck. That's destiny. There's the ice cream truck. You delight my fairy DNA. You get me to see the hidden delight of this life and to open my arms again and go on to my toes to see where the path goes. And for goodness sake, to just play. You radiate. I celebrate you. You hear my frequencies when they are tuned into your center. Though you may not know it, even though you are much younger than I in Earth rotations, it's you who is my mentor and surefire motivation. I had forgotten where my elation lived until you hung Byzantium purple circular tea party lanterns all around my inner shimmer. All around. 
my inner shimmer. I turned away from myself. Yours has been a friendship so very beneficial to my health. You so generously give the wealth of the word yes and the very essence of it. The precious lessons and the effervescence you have provided to me have been like ah, a sip of sacred goddess blessed spring water tea. Like the very best raspberry lemonade on a day hotter than heck. You've stuck out your neck for what and whom you hold dear. I am not just saying this, but you possess the clearest, the clearest treasure of internal and external spirit I have ever seen. You must have popped into this veil from the holy grail of dreams because lady, those beams aren't just found upon this dimension. Your treasured qualities are too endless to mention. You listen with your entire being and actually pay attention. With such strength, you have taken hold of my stubbornness to truly shift my perceptions. I've embraced so many of my imperfections because you show me how integral and full of unique beauty they really are. It should be no secret that you hold the truth of the stars. No matter how far these sometimes jarring, often enchanting, ever winding paths take us, we must continue finding one another by whatever means we may. In brilliant, really searching, working, weeping, bounding, leaping, loving new days. There are so many ways we can hold this gem we've created. Distance and outside resistance will never break it. Just remember, when the earth rotation tally gets too heavy for me, and you're still a young chickadee, we gotta shake it in Vegas, baby. There's so many more <gasps> desert and ocean, magic potions, sun and moon songs to tune into, lady. Today, we have this immeasurable gift to be right here, together. Right here, together. Lifting the haze and the weight this world creates to appreciate every single molecule of this connection. You've provided me with the rarest offering, a reflection of what pouring light with all your might inside and out can bring. <laughs> I'm, tur I'm oh turning on you. <laughs> this girl is it. <laughs> I'm literally like exploding. Like I am like teal. <laughs> We're both exploding. <laughs> you are so beautiful. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just like getting. I'm like getting all up in your. Oh my god. In your was... joyful love. I just. Okay. That was the most incredible gift anyone has literally ever given me. <laughs> Oh my God, y'all. I love this woman. I love this woman, if you couldn't tell. Yeah, I... And this guy, all he wants to do is get wet. Get wet, Gizmo, get wet. Have a party. I am literally like... <laughs> I love you. I, I love you. Teal is my obvious. Fairy soul sister from this lifetime and many, many lifetimes before and after this. If you can't tell. And no loud ass truck will ever come in the middle of our sweet ass energy mojo drive. <laughs> Never. We got peacocks, we got sunshine, we got kicked out of our spot. It was a lot. But this girl needs a whole book of poetry. And I, I'm so glad that she was willing to show you her beauty because it is immense. No, it is an immense beauty. So, oh you know, as is this, as is this, we are surrounded by immense beauty. We are immense beauty. <laughs> but oh you can God. you can hide big chunks of yourself under the floorboards. And I did that. And this girl dug them out <laughs> and made me stitch them back into my heart. I love you Teal. so much. I love Teal for the rest, for 
Oh my gosh, my love is absolutely immeasurable, immeasurable. There are no words, there are no like... <sighs> beyond time, beyond that time. That was the most incredible gift anyone has ever given me to like ever. Like I am like, I have like so much to just like process from what you said and like... <sighs> that was the I, I truly do not have words for how much that meant to me like that little I want that printed out oh, and framed we're gonna get a tattooed on tattoo your back I tomorrow we're gonna go I oh my god Teal, can I, I just need to give you the biggest yep, hug yep yep Ooh, muddy knees hug this is the best hug ever my knees just got the slickest mud <laughs> gift Oh my god, Teal, that is the most beautiful, beautiful poem. Oh. I've, oh. No one has ever, ever given me a gift like that before, Teal. You <laughs> deserve that and your own home planet, which still could not contain all of the beauty that you possess. Teal, same with you, sister. Teal, you are a fairy godmother to me. Like... Truly, to get my muddy knee. Truly, yeah, muddy knee. <laughs> truly, like how you have impacted my life and the magic that you have shown me is also immeasurable and immaculate. And I truly cannot imagine my life without you. Immeasurable and immaculate. That's like our <laughs> book. Are you kidding? It's our book. Okay. Oh my goodness. Give me I, some bubbles. We're gonna exit on your bubbles. Magic fairy I'll bubbles. stop. Like, I'm so glad you were willing to share your soul after that because so many people are afraid of even giving the tiniest little peek <laughs> of what their soul is up to. They just like draw the blinds. <laughs> Thank you for loving me. I love you. Oh, you just made such a good bubble world. And the and the geese are getting rowdy. I love you infinitely and eternally. Mm, immeasurably and immaculately <laughs> you are the butterfly wings of Saturn baby love Teal. you <laughs> yeah! oh! are you fucking kidding me Teal? I literally like mm. that was like you literally just gave mm. me your soul <laughs> yep I was still rolling <laughs> Okay, we're uh we're putting our souls in boxes. We out here. <laughs>